Good afternoon. My name is Karina Moore, and I am the Health and Human Sciences Educator for Purdue Extension in Orange County. In the Aging Well series today, we're going to discuss how to talk to your health care provider. At each point, you should have a plan, meaning you should have a plan before your visit, during your visit, and after your visit. About a week before your visit, start a list at home with any questions that cross your mind that you want to ask your doctor, because sometimes once you get there, you forget all those questions that have crossed your mind. So make the list at home, put it in your pocket before you leave, and then you can pull it out when they ask you if you have any questions or concerns. Take a list of all your medications, including the dosages, and take the actual bottles with you if that's easier. And remember that when they ask for a list of medications, that includes anything that's prescribed, over-the-counter, as well as any herbal supplements that you might be taking. Bring any blood pressure or blood sugar numbers with you that you've been charting since your last appointment. And of course, remember to bring your newest insurance card. And last but not least, take a trusted friend or family member with you to take notes while you're there. During your visit, Remember, this appointment is about you, so it is so important that you understand what is being said. Ask everyone to speak in basic terms if you don't understand something being said. Ask for the information in writing. However, if you are handed something in very small print that has a lot of medical terminology on it that you can't remember later, don't hesitate to ask the nurse to reprint that in a larger font and just to make some notes um, by crossing out some of the medical terminology and putting in a term that you will remember when you reference that later. And before you leave, repeat what you were told just to ensure that you understand the information correctly. So after the visit, this happens to all of us. There was a lot of conversation, a lot of questions being asked, a lot of information being given and you might not remember everything, or you might be afraid that you didn't remember something correctly. So never hesitate to call the office back, ask to speak to the nurse, and ask for any clarifications that you need. You can also consult with the pharmacist about any medication questions, such as when to take it or possible interactions with other medications that you take. And remember, when you go to make those calls, have a pencil and paper handy so that you can write down the responses that you get and reference those later. Continue to monitor and record anything that was asked of you, such as your blood pressure or blood sugar levels. Here are some helpful tools that you might want to take advantage of. There are a number of sample logs available to you online. Um, the one shown here on this slide is a blood pressure log. Um, you can also access a number of blood sugar log sheets. And if you need access to these to be printed out but don't have that at home, please feel free to contact me at the Extension Office in Orange County and I would be happy to help you with that. And so thank you for joining me again and good luck with talking to your healthcare provider and I look forward to seeing you next week for more tips on aging well. Thank you.